Today's topic is uronephrology. This part of interventional radiology is really demanding as the patients we are dealing with in this area are, offering, are often suffering from lifelong diseases and therefore require special and long-term treatment. Percutaneous nephrostomy is basically a misguided placement of a catheter through a calyx into the renal collecting system. And by image guided, we mean generally ultrasound or fluoroscopic guidance. Sometimes a CT guided uh, procedure is done. A patient who presented with a large collection uh, here in the right, Alec Foster, you can see on the ultrasound image, this is the corresponding CT picture, and this is a CT-guided uh, drain insertion, and this patient responded very well to the uh, drain, and there was no uh, recurrence on the short term. So how can we solve these problems? By connecting a vein to an artery, you get some big advantages. You get higher flow than a vein, and you get easier access than an artery and there is no need for a tunnel catheter. And this is more suitable for long-term dialysis. So as you saw in the example, the most common site is the forearm on the patient's non-dominant side. And the highlighted site right here is preferred because the vein and the artery are close together and both vessels are easily accessible to the surgeon. So he only needs a shallow incision.